good evening. My name is Ava Conda, and I've been told that you are looking for some candles. Is that correct? Okay. Now, your friend that recommended me to give you a call told me that you had a specific occasion in mind. Okay. All right. I definitely think we can uh, find you something. I have uh, quite a few options here. I brought uh, some of them with me. Some of them are samples. So, um, some of them are burned candles. But I do have brand new ones in stock. You can order as few or as many as you'd like of each one. And based on what you tell me about the candles and how you feel about them, we can always do a second round if you'd like that. So right now, I do have a candle burning. It is one of my favorites. It is very, very fragrant. It is very, very burnt. It is a Caribbean Villa, and it smells so sweet and summery. So do you like this one? That one is very, very beautiful. I love it. It's so tropical, yet really, really sweet. So I have a box here next to me full of candles, and I'm just going to start picking them up, and I'll let you kind of have a smell, and you can tell me what you think about them. I won't tell you the scent until after you smell them, so you can just kind of get a natural reaction. Okay. This first candle that I have here is a woodwick candle. Again, I'm not going to tell you the scent until after you smell it. This is a candle I have burned before. As you can see, the wood wick is burnt. So take a smell of that one. What do you think? Too strong. This one is Manly Indulgence. And the scent Ginger and Amber. It has fragrance notes of warm amber, lemon leaf, and oak moss. So this one is a little musky. It's a little more of a manly scent. So, you're not looking for something like that. Okay. Well, let's try this one. You like that one. It's a very, very fresh scent. It's Island Retreat. It's very fresh yet fruity. So this is sensational. And it is Island Retreat. So that's a good one. I'll put that in the good pile over here. And I will pull out another candle for you. Again, a sample. This one is pre burnt. It has a beautiful wooden top. Oh, the scent that just came out of it is beautiful. It is a little more manly. It actually reminds me of one of my old friends. And it is called White Patchouli. Did you like that one? Right, it's it's good, but I'm not I'm not sure it's really for the occasion that you are looking for. But you still like it? Okay. We'll put that over there in the pile as well. I have this one. What do you think it is? You think you know? It is like a beach scent. It's uh, 
sea salt surf coastal decor. They sell these kind of candles at uh, um, like a Michael's Hobby Lobby kind of, kind of places. Those kind of places. Do you like that one? No. You seem so excited about the beach scent. You were just excited because you knew. Okay. This is actually one of my favorites. Okay, go ahead and have a smell. It is a Christmassy scent. It does have a very evergreeny kind of scent. It is winter. Yeah, I'm not sure this would really go with what you're you're looking for. But it is a very nice Christmas scent. If you're looking for a Christmas candle, keep this in mind. This is also uh, sensational. Same brand as the one you already liked. Okay, so this is a very, very good one. You don't like it? Yeah, this one's Teakwood Myrrh. It's by uh, DW Home, which makes some beautiful, beautiful candles. Not your favorite, though, huh? It does have that more musky kind of manly scent, so I take it you're looking for something a little bit softer, a little bit easier on the nose. <laughs> Well, then I think this one might be out. Just to let you have a smell. I actually have two different types of this candle, so I think they're both not on your list. Here, let me tell you what it is. Let's smell. Again, a pre burned candle. This is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite candles. Yeah. It's mahogany teak wood. And body works candle. To me, this smells, I don't know, like like the Abercrombie store or the Hollister store. And you'd walk by, just get that like punch in the face of like cologne. But it's like a good punch to me. Anyway, I, you don't like it. So. Um, again, this is very, very similar. It's almost the same candle in another brand. It's uh, mahogany driftwood. So the same but different. Just, this one's actually a little bit more of a softer scent. So not so abercrombie punch in the face. <laughs> okay. So next up we have another wood. I don't smell that. I smell like soap. It's very clean. The scent is soothing eucalyptus. I'm not sure that I smell eucalyptus either, but it smells very, very clean. It's a very simple scent. You like it? Okay. Let's grab another candle. It is a fall scent. It's apple pumpkin. Farm apple pumpkin. It is a Better Homes and Gardens candle. This is a limited edition for the holiday. Do you like it? Not really. What you're looking for right now. Okay. You can keep this one. You might do that because this is a delicious, delicious candle. Okay, 
This is also from Coastal Decor, so this is another peachy scent. Take a sniff. I think it's similar to the other one. I think it's a lot different, actually. This one's called Palm Beach. It has a blue motif instead of a green one. I don't know, I find them very different. Next one I have, oh, so nice, it's so cozy, it's a very, very warm scent. You like this? Awesome. This is one of my favorites. It is another Better Homes and Gardens candle, and it is called Around the Camp. It is one of my favorites. I love this one so much. This is a very interesting one as far as jar goes. Very punching, I guess. Pungent would be the word. What do you think it is? No? I'm not smelling that. Here, take another sniff. Any ideas? Okay, like a sour apple. <clears throat> it is actually um, properly scented, smoothed, and aged whiskey sour. So it smells like a whiskey sour. <laughs> These candles are very, very nice. They smell very good when lit. The only thing I will tell you is that you uh, have to be very careful because you can't see the flame in this candle. It's also hard to see it on the ceiling. There's no real light coming from it. So if you do get any of the other candles in this brand. There are a few others that come in jars like this. <clears throat> Just keep in mind that it is very difficult to see the flame, so remember to burn, blow it out before it, it burns too long. It does get very hot. Not for you. Okay. I'm not offended, but it is a very delicious, delicious candle. Okay. I have one more for you to smell, and then we'll go back and make sure that you like all of the ones that we've selected. So this, oh, another one of my favorites. You like it? Yes, I'm so excited. This is actually called Better Together Honeymoon Bliss. And it is a white candle. And the scent itself is Honeymoon Bliss, Sand and Fog. Which I'm not getting a very beachy scent. I'm getting a very sweet, clean scent. It's very crisp. I love it. It's still somehow a very rich scent. You like it? Okay, so we have the first one. This I love your tree. Oh, it's so so sweet. It smells like berries and candy. And of course, vacation. Still like it. Okay. Then we have this eucalyptus woodwick candy. Mm. 
no on this one. Okay. So the next one that you chose was this white patchouli. This really does remind me of one of my friends. Good? And you like the one I was burning before, that Caribbean villa? I'll add one of those to your order as well. So how many of each would you like? How many of the uh, island retreat? Three? Okay. They are this size, so all of the sizes are true to what we have in stock. So three of these are good? Okay. And... White patchouli. Just one. Okay. And the around the campfire. We also have these in a slightly smaller size. About half. You want one of the smaller ones? Okay. And what about the better together honeymoon bliss candle? Just one. Okay. And what about the Caribbean Villa? Two of those? Okay. I will submit everything to the distributor. And based on the address information that you gave me when we first met, I will send everything there. Okay. All right. And please let me know if you'd like any of the other candles or if you'd uh, like to see some additional candles do have some more. This is just kind of an introduction. So I will uh, mark down which ones you liked, which ones you didn't like, why you liked and didn't like each candle. And based on that, if you do want to come around for a uh, second or even third try, we can, uh, you know, choose things that might be a little more to your taste at this point. Okay. So it was very nice to meet you. Thank you very much for your time. And, um, I hope to hear from you soon. Please, uh, you know, send me an email or a text and let me know how you like those candles, okay? And I hope you have a great, great event. All right. Thank you very much, and I, uh, I really appreciate your business.